Hello, this is Jack. This is the Arturo Triadic Coil. It's my first uh, Arturo Triadic Coil that I wound. It's about 40 winds, number 24 wire. And it's set up here with a, uh, a charger using the pancake coil on the bottom. And then there's just a single circuit here with a 2N3055. And there's a bank of 100 farads of capacitors. So 100 farads, and here's the circuit. It's quite simple, 12 volt supply at 2N3055 and a coil doesn't use a sensor at all then a single diode charger and a thousand and a hundred uh, farads of output so it's now at eight volts and declining because I'm running the light bulb so now we'll turn on the charger here just get the charger going if you can hear that uh, sound that's the sound from the, the little uh, disc magnet here so I can hear the frequency and as you can see, if you lift the coil up and down, it changes the frequency. And also, it's only using about 5 watts, well, in this case 6, but as you can see if you vary the resonant frequency, it changes the um, amount of watts used. There's down to 4. And yet it's still, if you can see here, it charges up. Let's take off the light bulb. You can see how it's charging. 7.74, 7.75, and now it's charging up the bank of 100 farad uh, bank of capacitors. So uh, there we go. I wanted to give you a shot of uh, first introduction to uh, Gregor Arturo's uh, coil, uh, which is used in this case in conjunction with a flat spiral. And it's all in series. The point is you can use this uh, thing, this setup with no sensor, with a variety of coils and uh, it's, a, it's a very simple type of circuit. So I hope uh, people build this and have fun with it. And um, uh, thanks very much. Here I'll take a final shot of the capacitor uh, charging up 8.19, 8.2 volts uh, to the capacitor. And let's, uh, while the charger is still running, we can power up the light again. Uh, it's a, a bifiler, uh, a two filament light bulb, so we can uh, see um, well, at it, it, some voltage, probably around 7 volts, the charger can keep up with the uh, discharge and keep powering the light. Now the point is, with or without the charger on, it uses uh, the same amount of uh, watts. So the power that you're getting to the capacitor bank is not increasing the source load. And that's an important concept, uh, the radiant energy. Okay, thanks very much. Thanks for watching. This is Jack.